Fox News alerters, we continue to watch live pictures. This from the U.S. side of the U.S.-Mexico border, and these are pro-immigration supporters waving their flags and looking towards the Mexican border, where you see that fence, where about 300 or so migrants from Honduras and El Salvador have all arrived, some climbing up on the fence, some chanting before they begin the process of seeking asylum. We understand that they have been coached, for lack of a better word, over the past couple of days on what to say when they present themselves and ask for asylum. With that, we bring in our talk radio panel, Washington, D.C.-based radio host Larry O'Connor hey. and California-based host Chip Franklin joins us just from about 25 miles from where those folks are and those live pictures are coming in. Uh, Larry, first to you on the optics of this. Yeah. Last night in Michigan, President Trump was talking about the need to build the wall. The contrapositive of that is that Republicans have the House, the Senate, and the White House have for more than a year, and we still have pictures like this, and wall funding is nowhere to be found. Yep. That's right, and it's because of Chuck Schumer and the Democrats in the Senate. They'll block it because it needs 60 votes, and this is great. I, optics wise, I'm sure that the Republicans want to send a thank you note to these activists down there because they've given them B-roll for campaign ads that might even flip to a supermajority in the Senate with 60-plus seats. I mean, if, if you've ever needed an image to show you why the president should get the wall that he promised and that he won the campaign on, it's these criminals crossing the border and climbing this fence. And by the way, Leland, I, you know I love you and I have great respect for you, but these are not pro-immigration advocates down there, as you call them. These are anti-border radicals. These are people who want to do away with our immigration laws, because if you're a pro-immigration advocate, you would know that okay. we have incredible immigration opportunities here in this country, but you have to do it legally. 